In the United States, we are discarding about half a million phones every single day. Every single one of those phones is worth $18 to $40. Uh, and we've launched a program which basically lets you give your old phone a new life on the front line of global health. Uh, we'll take your phone, we'll pay for your shipping in the U.S., we'll recycle it and use 100% of the proceeds to buy phones in local markets for our clinical partners. Our mission is to help health workers communicate coordinate patient care, and provide diagnostics using low-cost mobile technology. So, for example, our first pilot was at a hospital in a rural part of Malawi. Uh, we used $13 locally available cell phones, a laptop computer, and we connected the computer to the mobile phone network with 75 health workers sending simple text messages to and from the hospital. They were able to coordinate patient care, they were able to track down patients who had missed appointments, and they could coordinate distribution of uh, medicines to the communities. The first six months of our uh, original pilot, we saved the hospital and its staff $3,000 in, in motorbike fuel and around 2,100 hours of staff travel time. At St. Gabriel's Hospital in Malawi, they were able to actually double the number of patients they were treating for tuberculosis in just six months based on a very simple referral system. We really realized that there were tools that we could implement and bring to scale that made an impact right now. Uh, at the same time, uh, building tools that will work five years from now. That means we're going to implement SMS-based systems today and build MMS-based diagnostic modules uh, that let us do intracellular imaging using $15 camera phones that'll work a year and a half from now. We think that in five years, uh, we could be seeing millions and millions of dollars uh, flowing straight to these mobile health programs and helping us scale.